Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back. My name's Amy and today, finally, we have an update for Deck of Panning. I skipped last month because, well, I barely wore anything. So there was no point of coming on going, sorry guys, I didn't get any uses. So that's why I skipped and it hurt. <laughs> but we're back and we will be getting to roll, not roll, but pick new cards today. You know I love that. You know I love it. So let's just, oh wait, no. Let's not just go into it. Let me actually do the right things for once. Okay, this was created by Emily and Max. She was inspired by Books with Maddie and um, that was a TBR game, a to be read game and then lovely Emily decided to make this into a makeup panning game which we all absolutely love and she has put in different prompts this year that I'm like so excited about all the prompts except for one. <laughs> I mean it's not even the Joker. It's that, is it the king or the queen where you have to hit pan in something? I'm like no, <laughs> I will never hit it. But other than that I'm like give me any card. I'm excited. So today um, I think we have like three or four cards we're going to be rolling. I mean I keep saying rolling not rolling drawing can you tell i haven't been filming much <laughs> okay first card we got was the nine of spades which was most recent purchase and that was my natasha denona i need a nude now usually i will do the uses of what the card is but i'm not going to do that with this because i've used this four times doing four looks and I'm bored because I feel like almost every look looks the same I'm so glad I didn't pay full price it's a beautiful palette but I'm like oh it's just the same look over and over no matter what shade you're using it might have a slight difference so it kind of bores me but it would be a good palette for like Every day go to work if I went out into the office I work from home so that doesn't work for me but like every day wear to the office type of a look this would be perfect but for me it's kind of a boring palette I'm not getting rid of it I thought about it because I know someone who would want it but I want to play with it a little more later Right now, the, this, these shades are doing nothing for me. I'm all about the green. And I know next month I'm going to be all about the pastels. So I'm going to roll that one out because four different looks was enough for me to know how I feel. Hope that's okay. I should have used it nine, but it's going to be here till the end of the year if I have to use it five more times. <laughs> no one wants a repeat of last year, right? Gemini. <laughs> The next one was Nine of Clubs, which was SPF. So I brought in the Sugar Rush Skin Treat Poreless Tinted Moisturizer Broad Spectrum SPF 20 Sunscreen Wowzers. This isn't fair. I am wearing it today. The first time I used it, I hated it. But I have learned you need to really moisturize with this. So I put on my even though this has SPF, we all know you need more. I put on my SPF and it's like a hyaluronic um, SPF thing. So it's very moisturizing. And then I put on my, my um, Steel One Step Correct. And then I put on a glowy MAC thing. And then I put this on and I love it. <laughs> Today I tried something different. Usually I like do dot, 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 and then use a sponge. This time I just did my hands and moved it, like smoothed it around. I got more coverage this way. When I was doing it the other way, I have a lot of breakouts right now over here. And this time when I used my hands, then did the sponge to like push it in more. I like it better because it's more full, full coverage. Well, medium, you still can see I have breakouts going on, but anyways. It's a good, it's good. I like it. I will be happy to use it all up, um, which I'm so happy about because that first use, first use made me go, oh crap. 
I bought another, you know, complexion product that I, I'm not going to want to wear. But nope, I found a way to use it and I'm happy. I have used this five times. I have four more uses. Um, the next card was the Six of Hearts. That was oldest, so I brought in my Maybelline Color Tattoo 24 Hour. Um, it's called Inked in Pink. You guys, this sucker is so dry. I couldn't put it on my eyes. And I don't want to do the whole putting dural line in because I know this is super old. So I'm just going to toss it. I, only, I tried one, and oh my goodness, it was horrible trying to get it on because it was like scary. I was tugging my lid to get it on and I'm like crap I'm not gonna do this so I took it off this guy's going in the bin wah, wah. then our last card was the jack of hearts and that was a cream or liquid product so I brought in y'all I totally missed one but we'll go back anyways I brought in the Sydney Grace highlighter in on a cloud so it's a a pot one this is a very bold highlighter so I end up having to put it on my back of my hand and then take a different finger pick it up a little bit and then put it on and it leaves little glitters the other one I have doesn't do that so for this I've only been using it as an inner corner which I'm doing today but I don't think you can see it really and then I have it on the tip of my nose I'm using a different highlighter for here because this leaves little glitter particles, which I find so weird because their other one doesn't do that. But yeah, so I've only used this five times. I need to use it five more times because it was a jack. Oops, is that supposed to go in here? There we go. Okay, the one I accidentally skipped was the Three of Diamonds and that was Splurge. So I brought in a Pat McGrath Pat McGrath Labs, um, what are these called? Skin Finish Divine Blush in, this is the duo, and it's in Divine Rose 2. I have only used this three times so far, and today I'm only using this side. It's with all my, with all my cheeks. I used it three times. Oh, I get to roll it out because it was a three of diamonds. Woohoo! So we have, I need a nude one, two, so we have three rollouts, so we get to bring three cards, yay! All right, so let's see here. I am going to be using my Care Bear cards. I just opened them. Here's our two chokers, and you guys, I don't know which one I wanna use because they're both so freaking cute. What do we use? Do we go with Sunshine Bear or Bedtime Bear? Sunshine We're going to go with Sunshine Bear because I'm wishing the sun would shine a little more today. <laughs> Yesterday it was, oh here, I'm just, it's just going right back at the bottom. These have never been shuffled, so we're going to shuffle for, for a little bit. I have not looked at the board. I wish I would have used last, last month's because there were some good prompts on there. But that's okay. I'm sure there's good prompts to, today as well. I'm gonna do a little bit of this as well because these are so new. They're hard to shuffle. Let's try that again. I'm gonna cut them like there's a half there, half up here, and I'm gonna shuffle them again because I don't wanna have all the same suit. That's no fun. Oh, and I'm wearing my strawberry shortcake shirt today we're going full 80s cartoons today guys we've got the care bears for cards and strawberry shortcake for the shirt all right i'm gonna do this um so we need three i'm just gonna take them off the top so let's see what we get an ace of clubs that might be yeah, one of those we have to draw again but I'm not sure so and it's look good luck bear tomorrow st. Patty's Day Ruth I said Patty's you happy you've had me had that drilled into my head since meeting you st. Patty's there are no T's people <laughs> okay I'm gonna take another one Ooh, a 
bunch of theirs. Uh, King, I'm getting all the freaking. I'm getting the suit card. What do you call them? The face cards. I don't want those. This is cute. It's bedtime bear, cheer bear, and sunshine bear. Reading and eating popcorn. Oh, they're after my heart. Yes, they are. So cute. Okay, one more. You know what? I'm going to shuffle one more time because I don't want another suit. Uh, face card. Give me a number. All right, here we go. Oh, they're now backwards. I almost thought that was the Joker. Oh, this is cute. Birthday bear. It's six of clubs with the birthday bear. All right, I'm going to see what those are. Y'all, I'm not happy about the face cards. Maybe I will be. I don't know. Hold on. Let's check. Get out. Oh, I do like that card. Cool. And the king. <laughs> guys this is the card I didn't want it's hit a pan maybe I'll do a super shock I think that's the only thing I've ever hit pan on <laughs> so the ace of clubs is a good one it's a get out of free card I mean get out of jail free card I'm not gonna use it on this round I'm gonna hold on to that one Oh, does that mean I have to grab another card? Let me look. Prompts. Okay, so I do need to draw another card. So let's do that now. I'm glad I didn't go look for my stuff. I'm going to shuffle one more time. Oh, that was a horrible shuffle. They didn't go together. <laughs> All right. Please don't be the joker. Oh, God. The seven of clubs. Okay. So this one gets has to stay out of my deck. I had a panner, is that correct? So I got spotlight a panner, which that will be fun. And concealer. Boring. Okay, I'm gonna go grab my stuff and I'll be right back. Okay, that was fun. Alright, so <laughs> I cannot make a decision for the life of me, and that's why I don't do these kind of projects usually. I have actually quit some of the projects I started, so if you don't see those updates, now you know. Um, I can't, I can't leave, I can't leave Deca Panning. Ow, you know, I need to put a bumper on you. I hit my elbow on that freaking thing every time. So it took me forever to figure out which one. There's a project I'm bringing in. A, I had like four, so I did a random generator, <laughs> and then I couldn't pick a panner because I want to pick everybody, and I don't want anybody to feel left out, and yeah, so I called on Kim, and she told me to do a Tiny Decisions app, so that's what I did. So, okay, let's go. We know that we have the get out of jail free card, and I am one of those very few who does not like Monopoly. My family loves Monopoly and they will play for days. Like you leave the board, you go to bed, you come back the next day when you guys get all home and you go back to playing. Hell no. I need quick. I don't like anything that takes too long because ADHD people, ADHD. All right, so I'm gonna keep all, keep this. One of these things might be getting booted because of this later or if that mean old Mr. J comes around, Lucky Bear is going to help me. Oh, isn't that funny? Get out of free card is the Lucky Bear. <laughs> All right, so um, I end up pulling another card for that, and that was the Seven of Clubs, and that is Spotlight of Panner. So what we're going to do is I got 18 people in here, and if you are not on here, I'm very sorry. I had to stop at some point. So, all right, let's see who's getting picked. I love you all. Remember that. Who got picked? Erica Ashley. That's so funny. I didn't tell the wheel to do that. So Erica Ashley is going to come in. Um, I know exactly what I'm bringing in. I want this guy. 
Are you too? Yeah, we're going into spring. Okay. Um, for Erica Ashley, because we have the Lipathon project that we created, I'm bringing in a lippy, and it's going to be my Tom Ford Indian Rose. I absolutely love this. I would love to finish this this year, but I doubt it's going to happen because there's that much still. But this is such a beautiful shade, and I've been um, treating it like it's my precious. So uh, I need to use it. I love it. I can't afford to go buy the real deal. So I just need to use it. So I'm bringing that in for Erica Ashley. Um, and then we had, there it is. We had the Six of Clubs, which is birthday bear. And that was for concealer. So I decided to bring, I decided to throw it. <laughs> I'm bringing in my favorite concealer, which is the Nude Sticks Concealer. And this is in Nude One. I'm panning a L'Oreal one, and so I haven't been allowing myself to use this guy. So I get to use this one six times. Woohoo! This has to be used seven times. Um, and then my king of hearts that I really, 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 really didn't want is Hip Pan. So I decided to bring in a ColourPop Super Shot because we all know it's easy to hip pan on those. You just can't finish them. So I pulled out a bunch of toppers and then put in one through four, number four one, and that was Valley Girl. This has probably been used once. And it is, let's see if I can make a good swatch so you can see it. It's basically a yellow iridescent color. I don't know if you're gonna be able to see the yellow. But I figured I can use this as an inner corner. I can use it all over the, or just tap it in the center for a spotlight. So this is in until I hit pan. It'll be months. Trust me. So we've got three new cards and three new products. We still have to use the Sydney Grace highlighter and my skin treat before those roll out. And then I thought I would, um, be nice and let you look at some more of the cards because they're cute. I mean, are they not? Did you guys watch Care Bears when you were younger? Do you watch them now? I have the movies. I still watch them. <laughs> Yay. Aww. Aww. I wish they had the Care Bear cousins in here, do they? Oh, look at this. Tender, not tender heart. What's his name? Love a lot or something like that. Tender heart is the is the lion, the cousin. Look how cute that is. Hey Steph, this is your it's your Care Bear because he's an artist, just like you. Oh, don't give an Eskimo kisses. They're so cute. Aww. Aww. He's playing baseball. Cheer Bear was my favorite. Until the, um, well, here's the, the moon. Um, until the, the, the cousins came out and then I was all about the Care Bear cousins because they were super cute. This is me always wanting to take a nap. <laughs> I think that's it. Yep, that's basically it. I hope you enjoyed my cards this round, and I'm sorry I skipped last month. Trust me, it hurt me very, very much. Um, also, if you haven't seen me commenting lately, I'm sorry. Um, I'm trying so hard not to buy any makeup, and watching any beauty content including panning has made it very difficult to not get triggered to want to go buy stuff so i'm being very choosy on what ones i do watch like the ones i'm watching right now are people who haven't bought things in a long time and they're just working on the collection they have that's the ones i'm basically watching um you are all being put into my watch list you will get watched and i love you and i'm supporting you still i just gotta you know keep myself from buying stuff because money's getting tight all of a sudden. 
show you all. Oh yeah, I just had to pay a whole lot of money for some glasses. I'm gonna be wearing glasses starting next next month, guys. But you know what? I don't care because I really do want to see. <laughs> I was struggling trying to read the damn super shocks. So okay, I will stop talking. I miss you guys. I really do. That's why I'm like. Bleh, 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 bleh. So yeah, thank you for giving me some of your time. And I hope you enjoyed my craziness. And yeah, let me know if, um, did you get the Joker this time? I'm so glad I did it. But you know what? This kind of feels the same to me. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's going to take me a moment. Anyways, I love you guys. Thanks for watching and always giving me your support. I truly, truly appreciate it. I have been posting my eye, sh eye looks and stuff over on Instagram whenever I do put on makeup, which is maybe like twice a week. Um, so if you want to see me, I'm over at Amy underscore Melissa underscore makeup on Instagram. Until next time, you guys, I'll see you in the next one.